Hey guys, today the new 5.01 jailbreak was released for the iPhone 4S and the iPad 2. And since this jailbreak was released, both for Mac and Windows, there've been there's been quite a few errors that people have come across. And I'm going to just go through the errors with you and some solutions to them. All the solutions are not mine; they're on the Spirit website. There'll be a link in the description. So let's start off with the first error. Now, if you're stuck at the creating backup section of the jailbreak whilst you're in the CMD, which will probably look something like this, whilst you're in here. The most easy solution is to stop what you're doing, back up with iTunes before, then re jailbreak it. So, yeah, that's probably one solution. I'm reading these off the website, by the way. Okay, um, there's another problem how to fix syncjet errors. Syncjet errors. Uh, basically, what you have to do, the most common, the most common problem is. Uh, it gets to a stage and it says fatal line error. The most common fix for that is just to uh, stop the jailbreak, go into your iDevice, go into settings, general, and scroll down to reset and erase all content and settings. Be warned, by doing this you'd get rid of everything on your phone, so just back up beforehand. And once you've erased everything, it will, you need to set up your phone as a brand new phone through the uh, device itself or iPad or whatever. And once it's set up as a brand new device, go and re jailbreak it and it will work. And when it, once it's jailbroken, make sure you've got Cydia in there. And then once it is there, just connect it back to iTunes and then uh, restore, you know, put all of your apps, music, whatever you want back onto it and it'll be just like it was before, but now jailbroken. And for the fetal error on Windows Jailbreak 4S, like I said, <coughs> the the fix I had this problem, the fix I used was just to do what I'd done for the previous one, which is go into settings, reset, uh, erase and reset all data, erase all content and settings, sorry, and set it up as a new phone, and uh, yeah, it worked after that. Just to let you know, if if you still get if you still keep failing these, wait a few maybe tomorrow day after they will release uh, a user friendly one. Basically, it's just going to be much easier to use. You just press some buttons instead of typing loads of code and stuff. Uh, I'll make a video on that and put it up. So come back to my channel in a few days time or whenever. Well, I'll do it as soon as I can. Probably whenever it's released, I'll get up there. And yeah, if you have any other questions related to this jailbreak or any other jailbreak, do post a comment down below or send me a message and yeah if this helped you please like and subscribe but do also check out the spirit jv website because that's you know basically the hub of all jailbreaks so far sorry guys thanks for watching see you later